What is going on you guys? I'm Mike of Anabolic Aliens and today I got you a five minute tricep static stretching routine to cool down your triceps after your next tricep workout. And real quick before we get into it though, I want you guys to download my workout app called Exercise. It is a free download. It can literally generate thousands of workouts. So make sure you check it out. But let's not waste any more time. I know you're trying to cool down those triceps. Now there's gonna be 10 stretches and they're gonna be 30 seconds long to maximize the effectiveness. Let's get right into it guys. We're starting with the lying right arm lean back. And three, two, one, have your elbow on the ground and you're leaning back, guys. Push into the ground with your elbow and lean backwards to get that tricep activation, cooling down that muscle. So literally put the elbow on the ground, push down, and then lean back. Set your lower body up however you feel most comfortable. Have a different position to be able to lean back further. The further you lean back, the more the tricep will stretch out. Switch arms, dig it in, lean back, guys. You can use the other arm for support as you really focus on bringing that arm backward and really lean back to get that full stretch in that tricep. It's important to push your elbow into the ground and lean backwards, guys. But still have that emphasis pushing downward and then just bring your arm leaning backward to emphasize that stretch. And now the right arm over your body, just like that. So across, and then you're gonna lean out to the side. We're hitting it from a different angle now. With the same exact principle, push the elbow down, have it across your body, and then pull to the side. For your breathing, guys, breathe in your nose and out your mouth. You're trying to cool down. You're gonna bring down that heart rate. And switch sides. Come across, bring it down, and then lean. Lean to the side, guys. So cross your body, then bring the tricep to the side. Keep that emphasis pushing downward and then lean. Now we're coming on to the knee, guys. You're pushing your arm into the knee, push downward, bring the hand back and drive the elbow forward. Kneeling right arm, elbow drives. So again, push in. Bring the hand, like you're pushing the hand into your body while you're driving the elbow out. Really try to tilt it forward, guys. Get even more of a stretch. Switch sides. You drive it in, push the arm back, lean forward, drive the elbow forward. Remember, you're trying to push that hand into your body as you drive the elbow forward, and then get a lean forward. Really emphasize the stretch in the tricep. Drive that elbow forward, guys. Now we're gonna stand up. Now we're going right arm across, push the elbow back. So guys, you're pushing through the elbow. We're focusing on stretching the tricep this time. Before you're stretching the shoulder, now we're pushing back through the elbow, stretching out that tricep. Keep breathing. Five more seconds with the stretch. And switch sides, guys. Push back, bend the arm, push through the elbow. One more stretch each side, left in this routine. Cooling down those triceps, guys. Static stretching after your workouts helps with delayed onset muscle soreness. It really helps your muscles recover more optimally. Last one, we're bringing it back. Right arm behind, push back. Pushing down on the elbow now. Really emphasize that push down on the elbow to get as much stretching into the tricep muscle as possible. Keep 
breathing. Switch sides. Pushing down through that elbow. Shake out those arms, guys. You just cool down your triceps. Now, again, I highly recommend you do this after your tricep workout. Static stretching for after, guys. Now, make sure you smash that thumbs up button and the bicep static stretching routine will be coming soon. I promise I cover all the muscle groups with the static stretching cool down series, guys. I find static stretching incredibly important and something not enough people do. It helps improve flexibility, it helps decrease delayed onset muscle soreness, it can help enhance muscle recovery, and a ton more benefits. And one other that I really like for it is it really helps with pain relief. So if you have any tricep pain or even extra soreness, definitely I recommend you do this cool down routine. Now, make sure you subscribe guys and have that notification bell clicked so you never miss a new video upload from me. I will see you in the next video. Peace.